Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa Ellen Arianis, T-E-A, and this is Tea Time Adventures on YouTube. I've been a busy girl tonight. I think this is the fifth video I am recording tonight, but I also have been pretty absent for the last two weeks, so I guess I'm making up for lost time. So we did have my guys favorite cousin come to visit so she is staying here in town and she spent the weekend with us so we're having a great time she let her go through my bead stash because uh, she uh, likes to make uh, jewelry and let me show you what she made uh, I can do this what no I'm doing it wrong it's I think absolutely stunning and let's see if I can do this right so I'm Got a little bit twisted right now, but isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely. Still have the swatch from Ice Cream Beauty, <laughs> but it is purple and blue, and they've got the accent beads, and it's just a lovely little wrist bracelet with a, a little extra something something there. Um, I did ask her to make it a little bit longer because when I'm at work, it needs to move with me because this is my mouse hand. But she did a, a beautiful job. So Diane, if you're watching, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so what I have next in the theme of purple <laughs> is my social sampling box. And for those of you that don't know it, they are a... California family owned company that connects consumers with brands. Um, and it is only for California residents. They focus on Southern California, but I know that my subscriber, Sylvia Jackson, up in Northern California in the Sacramento area, she too gets this box. And I believe, quite possibly, Sweet Melissa, but I'm not quite sure on that one. Um, either way, I can leave those ladies linked down below and you can check them out um, either as awesome subscribers or with their own channel or with their Instagrams too. So what is in the box? What's in the box, sweetheart? Well, I've already taken the little confetti stuffing that they put in here because I don't want five billion little pieces of confetti stuffing all over my bedroom, especially with the fan on. I do apologize for the fan being on for those of you that are sound sensitive. It's just way too hot in here without it. So I'm going to go ahead and get into this. Now, they always give you a sheet. It tells you all of the names of what's in here. It gives you the at signs and the hashtags because what they ask of you is that you post pictures of the entire box using the hashtags and the at sign on Instagram or Facebook. Um, me doing a YouTube uh, video is a bonus they don't really care about, but hey, I need the content. So um, I have to have this posted on social media by July 31st, and then I upload the pictures of the social sampling on Instagram, not the pictures I've taken, but the ones that I've uploaded, which pro proves that I've uploaded it to a social media site. Um, and uh, it looks like a, a fun one this time. Um, and if there's any ever problems, like we've, uh, oh, oh, I know, I'll also get my friend Evie from work. Oh my God, duh. My friend Evie uh, also gets this as well. So I will link her down below as well. She may have already done her video, I'm not sure. So uh, please check all these lovely ladies out. So the first thing I see is a coupon, $1 off any cinnamon French toast sticks or buttermilk thick and fluffy frozen waffles from Kodiak. Now this is um, a very good brand. I think they're either higher in protein. Oh, <laughs> this is a Stater Brothers coupon. Not a regular one. Nope, find them at Stater Brothers. We do not have Stater Brothers in Santa Barbara. And we're in the tippy top of Southern California. Some of us uh, might still consider it the Central Coast. But Stater Brothers tend to be in Southern, Southern California, down near Temecula, San Diego County, etc., etc. So I actually can't use this coupon. So if there's anybody in the Southern California area that does have a Stater Brothers and is interested in this $1 off coupon for the Kodiak frozen items, the waffles and the sticks, please let me know. Um, I'd be glad to mail it to you. 
the next thing they always have something to do with mine and uh, wine and this always makes me think of Nancy Rounds who passed away earlier this year she was our wine connoisseur and she is definitely definitely missed so save eight dollars on any by mail on any grocery purchase with the purchase of one bottle of Louis Jadot J-A-D-O-T wine um, so there is that um, and then another one um, St. Francis, $6 by mail with the purchase of any meat product um, at your store. So I guess you, you have a little thing to fill out. I, neither one of us, my guy or I, drink wine, so these tend to go to waste. Um, now, we've gotten these before, and they always send one that's scented and one that's unscented, but these Tide Pods, and we actually use the Tide Pods, so I usually just throw the same, both of them, in a, in a larger load, and uh, it's really good. Free and gentle, as well as 4-in-1 Oxy. It was actually getting one of these in a social sampling box that made us get the bigger tub at Costco, so getting these little samples does help sometimes. I've got something in my eye, so sorry. Um, probably just sweat from my makeup. Okay, the next thing is Doritos Minis in Cool Ranch. The last time they sent us a uh, Minis, uh, I don't know if it's Frito Lay. Where are you? Um, it was Flaming Hot Cheeto Balls, which neither of us. Uh, eat, but we gave it to one of our neighbors named Tommy, and he really did enjoy them. So share the joy, share the wealth, right? So if you can't use it, pass it on to somebody who can. So there is that. The next thing is Wassa multi-green Swedish style crackers. Um, this is what they look like. I guess you could put a little bit of sour cream and salsa on top of these, and they'd be good for munchy, munchy, munchy. We do like to do charcuterie boards or charcuterie plates on Saturday or sometimes, um, excuse me, on Sunday, um, usually during football season or watching a Formula One that's later in the afternoon. And uh, so this would be a good little addition to that snack plate. Next thing is citrus medley flavored with natural flavors, zero sugar, clearly Canadian. We have sparkling water beverage made with water from the natural Canadian springs. So what do we have in here? Carbonated spring water, natural flavors, citric acid, stevia leaf extract. Uh, zero calories, zero, zero sodium, zero fat, zero carbohydrate, zero sugar. <laughs> it's invisible. <laughs> but you know what else is Canadian? That's my friend Charmaine. Charmaine is, uh, uh, she's one of my friends. I just adore her. And I will leave Charmaine's staycation down below. Does she have anything to do with social sampling? Absolutely not, other than the fact that she's Canadian. <laughs> So I will link her down below in a little mini shout out. She is definitely loves stickers. She loves books. She loves cats and she loves rainbows. So please go check Charmaine's staycation out. The last item here I am actually tickled pink about. Good cook. They do send a lot of really good kitchen items. I've had a juice squeezer before, and now they are sending a garlic mincer. Now, as you all know, if any of you have watched my Timu hauls, I've had a, a couple of different types of um, mincers or slicers, um, one of which broke not too long after I made a video, <laughs> and the other one is working very well. But this is interesting. This is a really nice garlic press. So I'm looking forward to that. Mince garlic and remove clove skin safely without the need of a knife. Stainless steel mincing plate is angled for better leverage and pivots completely open for easy cleansing. Skin removal platform pushes against the garlic clove to loosen skin for quick and easy removal. I mean, this is not an inexpensive little thing. I, I'm betting something like this, and I'm guessing, completely guessing without looking it up, because it is stainless steel, um, and that it's unconditionally guaranteed. I'm betting this thing is at least $10. So that is amazing in, of, in and of itself. If anybody wants to look it up, Good Cook Pro, the garlic press. Um, we have Doritos Minis, which I think is anywhere between 3 and $5. We have the Clearly Canadian drink. 
um, sparkling water. I don't know if there's a flavor to it. Just citrus medley is all it, all it says. I am seriously going to have to have a taste test with my guy on all of the sodas and drinks I keep getting in uh, my social sampling um, and things that I've picked up at the grocery store. I just keep forgetting that they're taking up the entire bottom shelf of the refrigerator. We also have the Wasa crisp bread multi-grain Swedish style crackers. Again, this is going to be good with a charcuterie board or as a snack um, either with uh, lunch meat and cheese or maybe with a schmear of uh, sour cream and salsa on top. We've got Tide Pods. Um, and again, they have the unscented as well as the scented. And having this, I think this is at least the third time we've gotten them in social sampling. This actually prompted us to go get a large tub of them at Costco. We've got the wine coupons, which we don't use, and they each have a stipulation. If you make an $8 purchase uh, grocery-wise, um, you can get some money back, or if you buy some sort of a meat with this wine, you can get some money back. Again, something I'm not going to use. And then we have the Kodiak, uh, $1 off, a cinnamon toast sticks or buttermilk thick and fluffy frozen waffles. These are in the frozen section, but it is specifically for Steeter Brothers, and you're only going to find that in the lower half of Southern California. There might be some in the LA area, but I know they're closer to um, Moreno Valley, Riverside County, San Diego County, down in that area, the lower counties of Southern California. So again, if there's anybody in Southern California that has a Cedar Brothers and can use this coupon, uh, please just let me know. Send me a message over on Instagram or Messenger, and um, first come, first serve, I'll send it your way. So that's it. That is my social sampling for July of 2024. This is a bi-monthly box of freebies. They only ask that you post the hashtags and the at signs, take pictures and post them on either Instagram, Facebook, or both. Me doing a YouTube video, I do tend to share with them once in a while. They give me a thumbs up. <laughs> But I don't know if that's that's not really their focus. But this is a family-owned business here in California, connecting consumers with brands. So thank you so much, everyone, for visiting with me today. Please leave me a comment down below. Which of these items interests you the most? Have you tried any of them before? Let me know. So please take good care of yourselves. Take good care of each other. And I'll see you around the net. Bye.